welcome to the video. We take a look at six strange and creepy videos that will most definitely make you turn the lights on. Can you make it until the end and prove us wrong here at Top Hop? Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe and the notification bell if you want more of this content. Number 6. The Painting Sean Robinson is a YouTuber that claims to have a haunted painting in his house. On his channel The Anguished Man there's a lot of other strange and creepy videos on this painting. Go subscribe to his channel if you dare to follow this ongoing story. The link is in the description. He has set up cameras many times around his house, and what he catches on camera will send a shiver down your spine. Sean has moved house three times with this painting, and these strange things keep happening which rules out the house being haunted so Sean now believes it's the painting itself that is haunted. Let us know in the comments what you think. My name is Sean Robinson, and I'm just making this short video to let you know. Number 5. Stop clowning around. This is Clyde the Clown who is in your normal clown doll. It is a 1983 Dynasty doll collection and is one of the creepiest clown dolls you will ever see. Here we see a man setting up Clyde before he goes to bed to try and capture something paranormal. The owner believes Clyde is possessed by someone or something as every night something gets moved around the house and even on one occasion found Clyde in a different room the following morning. If you look closely at the doll's head you will see it move up and down, and when done in three times the speed it looks even creepier. Do you believe that Clyde is haunted or is this all a hoax? You decide.
Number 4. The Girl in the Well YouTube channel Project Amber is a channel where CJ and his dog Lance travel around the world doing what they love, camping in their van. I will leave the link to Project Amber in the description, go check it out. What makes this video so interesting is that every other video on his channel is about just camping in his van and not anything about paranormal activity. But this time when the two friends park up for the night in a remote woods in France, they weren't alone. While CJ films some footage about his broken fridge, Lance starts acting strange off camera, which in turn makes CJ tell the camera about the creepy well he passed on his way into the spot. You can see CJ is visibly shaken when talking about this. 24 hours to, um, to settle, for the gas to settle. Now I've just flipped it upside down and back again, so I'm going to give it the full 24 hours, I think, to, uh, what are you looking at? You keep freaking me out, dog. There's no one over there. <laughs> Can you see someone? I'm not. There's actually a well. Just where I'm parked, you go down this little track, and there's a well with a big metal bar on it. And uh, originally I was going to go and park there, and I saw the well. Instantly started thinking about the ring, which when I was about, I, don't know, I think it was about 10 when it came out, scared the sh out of me. For like a month I didn't sleep properly. Um, so yeah, that's, I'm not staying there. Okay, I'm just seriously freaked out now. Um, a minute ago I could hear like really loud moaning, like, uh, like just booming across the mountains. So I've come down to where I could hear it. Uh, I got to this old well and it stopped. I mean, that thing's wild freaky. So it's smart at the ring. But just as soon as I got here, just from over there, there's no track or anything, it's just wood. This girl appeared, dressed like kind of like a monk, uh, no shoes, and no hair. So I said bonjour and that, and she res responded. Um, I asked if she was okay, but she didn't respond then, she just carried on walking. Um, so I carried on a bit and thought, I better double check. Went to go and find her again. She's gone. So up that way, that's where my van is, and that goes to the road down where she went that way there's nothing and there's nothing for miles where did she go I'm gonna leave And now the dog keeps looking over in that direction at where it is. So I'm like, nah mate, I might move. <laughs> but I can't. Oh, 8 o'clock, so it's been 24 hours since. That's annoying. Right, it's now 8 o'clock. It's been 24 hours. And the fridge has been on for the past 2 hours. So... It's not as cold as it should be, but it's cold. Maybe a little longer and that might be mystery solved. I think that's worked. I have not got a clue what was going on there. That was so weird. The well, the moaning from the forest, the girl. The, nah, maybe there's an explanation to it all, but I wasn't sticking around. I left. I booted it. I'm about 50 miles from there now. Uh, I saw the girl another two times. The last time I was near the van and she was running through the forest. I was, I, was I, I left. I was gone. I was gone so fast. I didn't even pack the van away. Um, yeah. Number three. Menger Hotel. This somewhat famous hotel in the heart of Texas is known for its paranormal activity and has a history of aiding dying soldiers during the war, so it's not surprising they get these paranormal events. The hotel get a lot of tourists each year staying a night, hoping to catch a glimpse of anything worth filming. 
This next couple were no different and wanted to catch something paranormal at this famous hotel. While her husband was out trying to buy some playing cards for the night ahead, she got just what she was looking for. While showing her potential audience around the room strange things started happening and she didn't stay long to see who was knocking or watching her. Minger Hotel. I think that's how you say it. Minger. Waiting for Mike. He went across the street to get some playing cards. Because we're just waiting for some sort of ghost activity. Nothing yet. We walked all up, up and down the halls in here. It's a pretty nice hotel though. There's a flat screen. There's two closets. Here's one of the closets. Space. And then there's another closet. With lots of space also. Lots of closet space. Hello? Mike? Hello? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh my god. 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 Where are you? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. posted a rather strange and creepy video. I will leave the link to his channel in the description. A worker in a supermarket in Scotland is going about her workday as per every shift. Or so she thinks. The worker is about to stand on a crate and put something on the shelf when suddenly something forces or pushes the crate aside. Which makes the worker fall over into other items. She gets up not knowing what just happened while trying to explain to her coworker, but clearly she thinks she just fell. Maybe she shouldn't see this video or she will be looking for work elsewhere. Is this a paranormal event or is there a normal explanation? I'll let you decide. Before we get to our number one, please hit that like and subscribe button if you enjoy these types of videos and stories. Now on to our number one. Not welcome. 
YouTuber Veronica Shannon uploaded a video about some creepy and disturbing things happening in their family home. And she caught it all on camera. If you want to follow Veronica and her story, I will put the link in the description. The things Veronica captures are downright terrifying and would make you think twice before opening your own living room door. This entity clearly doesn't want Veronica and her family in the house as you will actually hear the entity speak and it's not something nice. On one occasion the family challenge it while in the living room and ask is it in the kid's bedroom. And as soon as they mention this, their kids start screaming from the bedroom. Take a look at the video, but be warned this isn't to be watched in the dark. Are you here? Are you in the boys' room? Shut up, don't be here. What happened to you if something bad happened? <laughs> okay, go up and in the place. <coughs> that back towards that thing. You were following him live. I'm not even moving it. You finally moved? This door stuck. Get the fuck out of here. <coughs> Do you need help? Are you stuck here? Move the camera if you need help. Oh my god. Oh my Allow me to share some light on the subject. Next spring, two of the world.